Hello everybody. Uh, today I just want to make a video uh, to show everyone how to make their own cardboard uh, solar cooker, solar oven. Um, you need a few supplies. The first supply would be uh, for the cardboard. You want at least two boxes that fit inside each other. And these I got for free. I just went to a local store and they were more than happy to give them to me for free. And the next thing you'll need is glass or plastic. I uh, have this glass and I've already cut it to the right size that I want. And I also got this for free at a, a window replacement place that's actually down the road. They're, they're very nice. They just let me go through and get all this uh, free glass to use. And next you'll need tape measure, guard stack, ruler, whatever you need to measure. Uh, old newspaper that's going to be used for insulation. Uh, something to mark with. I'm going to use a marker because it'll be easier to see uh, than a pencil or pen would be, but you can use whatever you like. Cutting utensil. You can use scissors. I prefer the, the razor knife, but you don't have to use that. School glue. And this, I usually try to buy when it goes on sale right around school time. And this is usually about a quarter or 50 cents, but anyway, it should be way under a dollar. Black uh, spray paint, and then I also bought it for under a dollar. Um, need either something with a flat surface or like a straight edge, like a yardstick. I like using levels. You can see there's marks all over and they're pretty beat up, but they always work very well for me. And aluminum foil. If you don't have any aluminum foil laying around the house, I would definitely just go to a dollar store and get one or two rolls, but one should be fine for this project. So you're looking at a few dollars for, for all of this. Um, and since I wanted to save some time, I've already made some measurements, and I'll show you anyway. Um, from the bottom to this slot here, I wanted to do one foot. Um, and I'm not sure if you can see it or not, which you can definitely see here. I've made one mark on the foot and one mark on the two foot mark. Uh, my thought is this part right here, which is the one to two foot mark, that's going to be my flaps where I'm going to actually attach aluminum foil to make a reflector, or some people call it like a second sun. So I've already marked those off. I'm just going to go ahead and draw my lines on top here. Gone ahead and made my mark. And I'm going to take this little box out here, which I'll be cutting it up in a few minutes. So I want to go ahead and cut these lines here, and then that'll make this too far high with the flat. So let me go ahead and cut those out.
ahead, use my knife, and cut along these to that spot so there'll be a nice open flat. I need a sharper knife here. This one, uh -huh, that cuts way better. Okay. Let's go ahead and do that. Yeah, that is ten times faster and better. Last one here. Okay. I know I have where my flaps are going to be. I'm going to take my straight edge. And put that right on the line. I don't know how you can see that. Put that right on the line and fold the cardboard over. And it really shouldn't give you much trouble. Thank you very much for watching. Take care. God bless.